scorer. Okay, our leading scorer also had the most goals. Sometimes it doesn't line up like that, but uh, but this guy kind of took care of business with both both goals and assists. So our most goals, our top scorer with 27 goals, 24 assists, 51 points is Cole Sparks. <laughs> Thank everybody uh, that shows up out here, you know, support of West High School Cross. Um, you know, coaches, Kevin, probably helps me more than he does with the kids with all the injuries, but I appreciate it nonetheless. Uh, JB coaches to the right, middle school coaches, my father right here, and then the, uh, the reserve tables, everything that you guys do over there is absolutely fantastic. Um, parents, thank you so much for being as flexible as you are with the schedule. Like Coach said uh, before, four o'clock start. You know, I'm in Brooklyn. I'm trying to hustle back, and I can only afford so many speeding tickets. So I appreciate the, uh, you know, the late, the late start that you allow us to have. Um, and then ultimately the boys. You know, I, I appreciate everything that you've done this year. The effort, the commitment. You know, just the absolute. You know, just the, the grittiness that you showed day in and day out. You know, uh, I came across a quote. Um, you know, some point this year that I felt <clears throat> kind of really showed us what we were. And uh, the credit belongs to the man who is actually in the arena and who at the worst, if he fails, at least fails while daring greatly. And if you take a look at our score sheet, you know, we had about seven, eight, one to two goal games. And we, we pretty much split half of them this year. And that's a tough thing to do. Um, to consistently be in those tough moments, those tough games, and day in, day out, come to practice, willing to prepare, willing to get ready for the next game, um, and not lose sight onto what's truly important. We always talk about the regular season prepares you for the postseason, which is the real season. And these games, you know, there's no better preparation than I felt like we had a postseason the entire season with how many close games that there were. And, how gritty our boys were and you know just uh, can't thank them enough you did an absolute fantastic job um, and you know the boys that are returning we're getting ready gearing up getting ready to work and the boys that are uh, you know parting ways good luck in all your adventures and you know you always got a always got a home here at West Ice and we're always here to help so don't feel don't feel afraid to come and reach out um, but back to what coach got me up here for which is the coaches hustle award uh, this individual pretty much did everything that we asked and then some. Started off as an offensive mini, then a defensive mini, then all of a sudden we throw him on the wing, he was on man up, he was on man down. I think the only stat that he didn't record was a save. Uh, and you can't think enough of uh, you know what this particular athlete was able to do. Conrad McChaney. Once, once we got him onto the wing, um, you know, obviously, you know, as lacrosse goes, the face-offs always be, you know, going in which way, and there are some times where he would just hit into kids, and they'd be flying off of him, and sometimes I'm pretty sure he was apologizing to him for as nice as a kid he is as he's hitting them on, on their way, but uh, great job. Um, appreciate all you did, and great job this year. Okay, now uh, I see the food is ready. Okay, well, parents, uh, I messed this part up last.